Right, okay, so Windows Vista Home Basic has almost finished installing on the computer. Now it will ask you for a username and a password. I never put a password in and I always call the computer user because uh, it's going to just be me using it but it's just easier. So then you push the next button and it just says use a PC, pick your background, I'll pick the nice spacey one because I'm into astronomy. I just had to bring my telescope mounting because it's pouring with rain, which has really annoyed me actually. <laughs> anyway, that's nothing to do with you lot anyway. So, okay, ask me later. I always say ask me later. Now it says 21. It's no, no, it's not 9 o'clock at night, believe me, it's not. It is. Uh, <coughs> oh. oh yeah, yes, you can do it. Fifteen, ten. Or you can use these. Fifteen, ten is close enough. Thank you. Start. Now it should shut down and restart. If memory serves me correct, yes. And now it's. Please wait while your performance of your computer is tested, and then it, it goes through this. And there's a little bar at the bottom there. Just go on to there. It's, it's quite quick actually. It's only taken about 15 minutes to install it. I, Windows Home Premium takes quite considerably longer. I think it took 45 minutes and I had to reinstall it twice. If you're doing Windows because your Windows Vista is corrupt, you'll need to do something else afterwards. If you are intending to sell it on and you think, oh I'll, del I'll overwrite Windows, that'll clear it off, that doesn't clear off all your data, you have to install it twice. There's a file in there called Old Windows you must get rid of that first because all your files and documents are, in, are kept in there what I did was with this one here because I'm selling this for somebody else on eBay the one that I'm now re resting on um, I reinstalled Windows and then I deleted that file and I re reinstalled Windows so it's got an old copy of Windows on there there's nothing in it so and I've deleted that off as well. It just so that, that, that any data is, is actually done. So you'll have to do it twice and get rid of the old file um, and then reinstall Windows again because it keeps a copy of your old copy of Windows pairing your desktop. So <coughs> there won't be anything on the desktop. I'm just going to run through a couple of things with you. Right, okay. Now this is, this is not optimised to this screen actually. And I'm not going to optimise it to this screen because there's no. Well, actually, I might do because it's. Uh, I hate these. Get all these things on Windows Vista. What do they want them for? Close gadget. Yes, please close gadget. Close everything. Ah, horrible. Yes, I did close this over. Right. Okay. Control panel. I've got to optimise this screen, make it a little tiny bit smaller because it's, it's not uh, it's not perfect. Now I don't use I use Windows Vista a lot, so let's go through some of the things. getting started with Windows. Back up your computer. Don't need to worry. Uh, we know about that. Can it work? Okay. Let's go to classic view. It's easier. That's better. There'll be a display setting down here somewhere. This is the Windows update there. Where you get your updates from. Not this will ever probably this won't be updated very often, if it at all. I've got to be installing things on it, then put them on the uh, internet. So I'm just trying to find the uh, system. All right, it's Vista Home Basic. There you go. Memory one one meg, but one meg about one meg. So so 
So there you go. Advanced settings. Continue. There's, the, 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 there's computer name, hardware, any hardware that's on it. Device manager. Let's look at device manager. No question marks anywhere. No. So that means every all the drivers are installed. So that that's one <laughs> one big advantage. Advanced. Don't need to worry about those. You know, they don't, don't need to worry about all that. I wouldn't touch anything unless you're unless you've been told to do it by somebody or someone's done to do it for you. Let somebody else do it for you, actually. Right. Windows update driver settings. You you can update your driver settings as it says there. So you can tell, ask Windows Update to check if there's a more up-to-date driver uh, can solve some problems. And you can also see Device Manager there, Remote Settings, System Protection, Advanced System Settings. So, <coughs> Colour Management, this is another thing that uh, just comes up with the profiles. I wouldn't worry too much about these, but occasionally Windows 7 is always forever showing that. I've noticed that with my dad's computer that we that we built. It's always showing that. So it's just uh, ah network and sharing center. Here's it, something very interesting for you. Okay, now we're not connected to the internet basically because I've got no wireless network card and I'm not going to connect it to the internet anyway because I don't want to because you have to download all the updates and etc that have ever been made. And, uh, and we have a download limit here. So, this is it, you know, view computer and devices, there are no devices, I know that, I didn't need it, it to tell me that. Connect to a network, it will try and connect but there's nothing for it to connect to, that's if you're going to connect. It will say, oh look, cannot find any Windows networks, that's because obviously it's not plugged into anything. Uh, set up a network connection or network, manage network connections, diagnose and repair, it tells you that what's wrong with the computer and it normally tells you, that, that, especially with wireless, that it's got low wireless speed, but in this weather out there at the moment, my gold, that really knocks out our, because uh, we, we use, we use um, Sky and when it rains it tends to knock things off, well, it's just, the telly doesn't work for a start, right we'll go back to the classic, classic view, <coughs> Ah, before we do that, we'll go to Windows Defender. This is Windows Defender. Now, this is a way of scanning your computer. I personally, I'm going to go. I buy another uh, something like Norton's or whatever you want to buy. You can download them off the internet. Be very careful downloading them off the internet. Just, just make sure you, someone else has used it. And they know it works, and that, that there's nothing. There's a number of programs out there that masqueraders. Um, PC, antivirus PC scanning software and they're not, it's a con. Um, there's some very good ones out there as well but you need to, re I can't, I cannot say to you because I only ever use one, I only ever use a certain make of um, antivirus that I, and I'm, you know, so I can't tell you to use it so, well I could but I'm not going to anyway, so. Now the the performance it's telling you calculations graphics yeah Windows error because it's it's not running we're not running uh, enough to do we haven't got enough power really to run um, Aero properly and I'll show you down anyway because I don't want it. I don't like all these things on Windows. I don't. I don't, uh, don't like any of them. Right. I don't seem to be able to find the the screen settings. I, I don't know why I can't find the screen settings. Probably because it's so big. I'm not used to seeing it like this. Right. Let's see what we can find here. Ah, just screen resolution. There you are. But highest is 32 bit. Now this is a one, two, four by s that one by 
1024 by 768. Now, if you're not sure, it should say somewhere on the screen or it should then say in the box that you bought it on. It'll always, normally always tell you. Um, okay, so hopefully that'll be, yeah, that's a bit better. This is this is the way I know Windows. It's, it goes it's terrible when, you, when you're when you looking at something you don't know. That's, I would have found that instantly because <laughs> I couldn't find it. But anyway, it's not important. Okay, so once you've done all that, you can <coughs> shut the computer down or you can uh, initialise Windows, which is what I will do. I'm not going to do that on, on video for you because I, I don't think I need to. So Unless someone really wants me to, but you can email me through the YouTube account and ask me to do it. Um, and I'll see where, like, what I can do. It might take a few, little while. So, anyway, I think that's all for now. Oh, excuse me, I was up till two, two, two twenty this morning trying to trying to video the moon. Blooming thing. Anyway, that is me done for now. I'm gonna sit down and have a rest. Okay. So that is installing Windows Vista. Home basic. I hasten to add. Um, you got any questions? Uh, send me a question, and I'll uh, I'll endeavour to answer it for you so I'm going to say goodbye now and I hope that uh, you've enjoyed the video